What's up, guys? Um, my cat is acting kind of strange again. Um, she acted like she didn't want to go in that room again, uh, like three times in a row. I'm in the kitchen. I'm making French fries. I'm making a hamburger. I'm listening to a little bit of music. Blah blah blah. And the cat just did not want to go in the room. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to go in there and I'm going to ask some questions. I got the recorder going. If I catch anything, great. Oh shit, I got to change the batteries in this recorder soon. I only got one bar left on them. But yeah, here I go. I don't have like my headlamp or I would have the lights off, but I don't feel like doing that shit right now. I'm not scared. I just don't feel like being in the dark. Oh. Oh. There goes the cat. Run it away. I don't get it. I just don't get it. She's never afraid to come in this room. That's that's what is kind of confusing the hell out of me. I don't understand it. So I'm going to. Are you the reason that my cat is afraid to come in here? That was the first time my cat has ever been hesitant on coming in this room. Are you, are you scaring her? Is that why she doesn't want to come in this room? I don't appreciate you scaring my cat if that is true. I'm gonna stop the recording real quick right there and then I'm going to turn it back on. I'm gonna make another recording. I'm gonna do a just a quick, you know, quick uh, questioning thing again. So. Stop that recording. Actually, let me go flip my burger real quick. Beautiful. Okay, my cat was afraid to come in the room. Are you the reason why she was afraid to come in here? Or are you scaring her? Why was you scaring her? Can you move something?
the other day you knocked over the mirror. That was pretty impressive. I wish I was in here to see it. I wish I was recording so I can see it. What the fuck was that? I keep feeling like vibrations under my under my foot. Um You've been quiet for a long time. Why are you all of a sudden just now starting to make noise? Starting to act up. Stop that and listen to it again. Hold that thought. I gotta change the batteries in my recorder. Alright, guys, I'm back. I'm a little bit mad. I kinda burnt my burger a little bit, and on top of that, I completely forgot I was making french fries, and they're almost completely fucked, so whatever. Anyways, I'm gonna listen to this real quick. Um, I don't know if I got anything on that or not. Um, honestly, I kind of screwed up and didn't turn the music down like an idiot. So, um, 
yeah, I pretty much can hear. All I heard was Mac Miller in the background, so <laughs> which is fine. You know, that's 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 fine, but not whenever you're trying to see if you're uh, uh why why your cat is afraid to come in the fucking room that she comes into every single day. At least twenty times a day she's in here. Hell, half of the time, half of the time she lays in here. She literally lays up on the ledge. It's kind of weird. Just all of a sudden this week, today, just just today, she's afraid to get up. You know, even come in here. Uh, it, it hasn't even been all day. It's literally been you know within the last hour. She's been scared to come in this room, which does not make a bit of fucking sense at all. So. I'm going to listen to this in a little bit more detail. Um, I'm going to listen to it with my headphones to see if I caught anything. And um, I got to upload it on my laptop. I got to try to figure out how to mess with that that video editor. Otherwise, like I said, this is just nothing but a big waste of fucking time. And I hope not, because that's something that I've always wanted to do. Is I've always wanted to make. You know, I've always wanted to do like the online uh, YouTube account thing. Um, you know, like make funny videos, make cool videos. You know, I've always wanted to do that since I was a kid. Um, as much as I'm not a people person and I like keeping to myself, I also like to, I also like to entertain people. I like to make sure people's happy. You know, I always put other people in front of myself. That's unfortunately part of a part of depression that a lot of people don't realize until a lot of the time it's too late is people that are depressed they like to make sure or diagnosed with depression they like to make sure other people are happy or taken care of or something like that before before they you know them before taking care of themselves um it's not you know i'm not saying that I'm depressed or not you know I was diagnosed with depression a couple of years ago <sighs> since I've gotten sick it's gotten a lot worse um, I I'm trying to get you know I'm trying to make myself a little bit better and, um, and you know basically just making videos is, is helping it's kind of a little bit of release since I can't play football and all that shit, so, um, but hopefully here, hopefully here in a couple months, I'll be back to my old self, I hope, <sighs> fingers crossed, you know, but, I guess we'll see, but, I'm going to go eat. I'm going to keep the camera close by. I'm going to keep the recorder close by. Because. Since the mirror fell. Yesterday or the day before. Whatever day that was. I can't. I can't really remember. I think it was yesterday. But since the mirror fell. I've noticed that. There's been you almost don't feel alone in the house. You kind of always feel like there's eyes on you. So, oh, Ashley said something to me yesterday. She told me 
couple weeks ago, apparently, we were laying in bed, and I stretched, and she said that she seen what looked like a human face underneath my back, which is really weird, made no sense, I don't understand what she's talking about, but she said that she's seen a human face underneath my back in bed, and apparently it had red hair and a red beard, you know, I, I don't know, I don't know if she was, I think she was sleeping, and or or dreaming or just wasn't fully awake and you know she was in between sleeping and awake you know the twilight shit um but i don't know she told me this and it was kind of weird um i don't know what to take of it but there's been a lot of weird stuff happening since we've brought that mirror home and I keep saying that, but we've had a gnat problem literally within the last two weeks. And we've never had gnats in the house. Um, so, that's just a little bit strange to me. I don't understand why, but I got it taken care of. I finally got pissed off and I got it taken care of, so. But, anyways, like I said, I'm gonna go eat. I'm gonna keep everything close by. I'll talk to you guys in a bit. Later.